welcome back to Ask the Brunettes. Today, Kathy is joining us once again. Hey. So, what do we have for today? Well, this is kind of a long question, so um, bear, bear with, with us. me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, girls. This is kind of a complicated story, but I'll try to sum it up the best that I can. I used to date this guy casually for not long. It was just six months on and off. He told me he wanted to date me seriously, but his actions never matched his words. I ended it because, you know, feelings suck and I didn't want to get more hurt. There were no hard feelings at the time. I realized we didn't want the same things. We actually remained friends. Kept in touch here and there. Fast forward a year later and the same guy is hitting me up to hang out and stuff. I saw him because I missed having him out, hanging out with him as a friend. I give him the be be benefit of the doubt. Anyway, I know very dumb of me and things didn't change. After I saw him, I told him. I thought after all this time... I thought we were done with our own. There were no hard feelings at the time. I realized we didn't want the same things. We actually remained friends, kept in touch here and there. Fast forward a year later, and the same guy is hitting me up to hang out and stuff. I saw him because I missed ha hanging out with him as a friend. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Anyway, I know very dumb of me, and things didn't change. After I saw him, I told him I thought after all this time, we were done with our old habits, and he pointed the finger at me saying, what did I expect? I apologized and told him I was sorry. I thought things changed since we literally remained friends after all this time. I realized I should not have apologized for knowing what I want. He should apologize to me. This guy manipulates me with his words and I fall for it every time. Before I decided to even see him, this was going on for three months. He was asking me almost every weekend or so to catch up and hang out saying, I want to see you, it's been forever, let's do something, etc. I said no until that day I decided to say yes, finally. There was even a time I was out on a date and I told him I couldn't talk at the moment. He called me three times and messaged me nonstop. I had to meet my phone. His actions never matched his words. It's so confusing. It sometimes feels like a cat and mouse game playing with each other's feelings. How do you get over someone who kind of used you? I know self-love is always important, but I'm so heartbroken. I like this guy so much. It's insane. I am wrapped around his finger and I hate it. I ask myself, how did I fall for someone like this? Girl. There's no self-love there. If there was self-love, you wouldn't be wrapped around no one's finger. You would be your own person, you know, you would get over it. I feel like, to a point, you're kind of depending on him because if if you saw how bad he was treating you and just using you whenever he wanted to, you would realize that you would leave. I feel like at this point, he's just bored. I feel like he's just bored and he's trying to see, like, which girl, like, like bites the bait do you get me mm -hmm. and since you always bite it he keeps coming back to you but yeah. once he finds someone else to bite it he's gonna push it to the side once again you're gonna be heartbroken all over again and it's gonna be the same cycle a cycle is never yeah, gonna end and you're never gonna you know find that other person who you deserve because you're always gonna be thinking about this guy yeah there's no reason for you to be stuck on this person if this person isn't giving you anything of what you want if he's not bringing anything useful to the table anything that makes you like truly happy then what's the point of yeah. getting stuck with him maybe he's really cute maybe he's really nice when you guys are together but when you really think about it what is he providing to you and if it's right. nothing there's yeah. no point you gotta think you know the pros and the cons if the pros definitely outweigh the cons then i guess maybe it's worth it but at this time it's looking like the cons. Yeah, and at the same time, if a guy really wants you, like he wouldn't you make that? it like yeah. his mission to make like to make you like his girlfriend or whatever it may be. If he's not making it that mission, then it's clear what his intentions are. He's just are. using you. Yeah. yeah. You shouldn't waste your time on someone like that. You deserve better. We all deserve better. So. <laughs> yeah, we do, and. I would just say to, like, if you want to confront him and just be like, hey, look, this is it. Like, this is all that there is going to be between us. Just stay friends. Cut it. Snip, snip. <laughs> Cut yeah. I think, I think if you want to just keep it civil, just talk to him and tell him how you feel. Yeah. And then do that. Because <laughs> he's not it. It's going to be a weight lifted off his shoulders. Yeah, you're going to feel a little heartache for, like, a month. You'll get over it. You don't need yeah. someone else, though, to get over it. Like, get over that. Way. Yeah, love yourself. Love first. yourself. Yeah, get over it. Figure yourself. out your flaws. Figure out what you're good at, you know, and highlight your good things and, and work on your bad things and just love yourself. Amen, sister. <laughs> uh, anything else? No, I think that's all. Pretty much it, right? Yeah. Don't let nobody drag you around, girl. No. Not worth it. Don't do it. 
You're gonna look back and you're you're gonna be like, wow, I wasted so much time on this person and he wasn't even worth it. Exactly. The one that's meant to be is probably there on the side and you don't even notice him because you're still thinking yeah. about this other one. It doesn't deserve you. Just do you, boo boo. Yes, man. Do you. So, snip it <laughs> and yeah. you'll feel better. Okay? Yeah. So I hope this was helpful. If you guys have any other questions, leave it in the Ask category and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye.